No, because baby, look, why Miss Natalie be eating? Because, yay! I run my city from the west side, big to best, I do a day to shite. Wayne, Louisiana, Dr. Dre, the Los Angeles, this is it, bitch, Michael Misfit. Huh, day, a legend and moonwalk, sliding across the stage in 87. This that Tupac out the window, both hands throwing up that middle finger. Fuck them other niggas, ratchet bitches in my demons, yeah, I'm queen well what is up y'all and welcome or welcome back to another hair video child we got a sponsor so uh unlike you saw me before child right now i look like somebody uncle yeah i do but this is gonna fix that <laughs> camera tricks thumbnail y'all already know thumbnail <laughs> thumbnail again thumbnail thumbnail now i was hugging the pack before i even got it open baby but i felt like i already knew what was up in there because i knew it was some curls up in there and the fact that they was able to compact ooh, that in that little package okay child look at how i bust her oh man y'all know i love me a good old bag child now baby as i lick my lips in pure bliss because i am so pleased with the packaging and the curl pattern of this wig from the inside of the plastic i know it's gonna be everything that I desire, child. Let me show you everything else. Wig cap, of course. Okay, need it. <laughs> I thought. <laughs> Lashes for my girls that wear them. I don't, so my mama can have them. But them clips, I need and love. Why? Because they multi-purpose. <laughs> Bow, don't wanna wear no bra. Attach it together with them hair clips. Anyway, child, I had to cook up something special because y'all know that curls and, like, curls is my thing. But y'all know how I feel about long hair, okay? I'm not sure why I pause for the calls, girl. But anyway, let's lay this hat on down, child. Now, of course, there's always got to be a hater in the room, but I'm putting this little lot of body on. I wanted to see how long it would take me to lay this wig down without my usual breaks because y'all know I will do that, okay? So I have been slipping on my pippin' with my vitamins and whatnot, so that's why my edges is looking lackluster. But don't worry, I done got back in the game and they coming back in. But right now, my head look like foxes done sucked on it okay that's what's going on right now but don't you fret my pet because our friends over at shine hair have sent me the fixer up ah, the problem solver amen amen so don't worry about what i got going on up underneath this wig you need to worry about what's on top of this wig or what's on top of my head, a.k.a. this wig, okay? Now, usually I give y'all a old nasty story time, but we didn't even have that much time. Why? Because this wig did cut out a lot of the work for me, and it was something else on my heart to talk to y'all about. And this hair video is going to entail boundaries, child. Um, I don't know why that message was on my spirit to share with other people. I, too, am in a season of setting boundaries for different things, different people, different situations, and it has been a difficult level. It's almost like life has been set on difficult mode, okay, in setting boundaries for people and not allowing, you know, not allowing people to complete actions that just don't serve you in any way whether if you're a person that likes to give and they're not a person that likes to receive and they just they don't know how to receive you or whether you're a person that likes to speak and they're a person that just don't like to hear people talk you know what i'm saying it's a plethora of things that you can set boundaries for and i am working through them and i know somebody else is probably going through it too child but let's get into this wig right quick baby this piece of sorcery before you is a ready to wear glueless water wave seven by five lace closure pre-plugged curly human hat pre-cut wig you need to hear that again baby you need to rewind that part because that was a lot to say she comes in 24 inches with 180 percent density it's giving you 1080p it's giving you 4k okay so when they say hd lace that's just what they mean and i am a witness and by the end of this video you will be too baby i had to break out the bifocals just to make sure that i was looking at what i thought i was looking at especially up in them baby hair areas because i do not know how to plug no wig i already told y'all that before i do not know how to bleach no knots baby this wig came pre-plugged pre-cut so y'all gonna see when i put it on you ain't gonna be able to see no lace but look at how my fingers run through that curly wig orgasmic look at how my fingers run through that curly wig when i tell you now let me just go ahead and throw it out there for the people that have to find anything to pick apart y'all it will shed it is a long curly unit it is going to shed it is not coming out no scalp it is coming out of somewhere that somebody done poked and probed and tied it's gonna shed but baby look at that 
Look at now when I tell you I used to be scared of AliExpress wigs. Okay, this is coming from somebody right now. Look at how day after day seems like I had to hold that wig close. Baby, I kid you not, hands down one of the best constructed wigs. I don't know where that hair came from, but baby, hands down. If they ever want to collab again with a short curly hair, long curly hair, I love they curly hair. Okay, I absolutely adored this wig. Okay, now this gave me pause, baby. It was not no combs in the wig but they were in the bag and I didn't see it till afterwards child so you got to spray that thing down like a Chevy now because it is glueless that band is tight okay I had to loosen the band up and y'all know how small my head is that little band is tight okay so that is why the glueless thing would work but me personally I got to know because I sweat child and then the way that the wig was constructed it's almost like uh not a U part not a U part so much, but like a T part, if that makes sense, okay? So you are able to keep your edges out. Now, if you want to pull, if uh, if I would have had the wig a lot looser, I could have pulled it more up front. I did not mind having my edges out on the side. So you're going to see that. I wanted to throw that in there to you. Look at, look, look at that. And baby, the only reason I respect this so much, you know, back in the day when everybody used to walk around looking like Indians by the hair, like Princess Jasmine and whatnot, I respect so much a wig that is plucked like that because baby, that is genuinely how my hair looked after I started paying rent. That is just how my hairline started to look after bills and BS and all that other stuff start coming into play. Baby, that's exactly how my hair looked. Now look, see right there where I showed you where the edges is out at? I was okay with that. A, because I'm trying to get my edges back, child. Now, y'all know I already got my Bomba Lace Melt and Serum. Again, these are not glues. This is a glueless wig. If you do not want to add anything to it, you don't have to. I like to do it for extra security. And once I take my, put my wigs on, baby, I'm not trying to take them things off for a couple of days. Contrary to what you believe, child, it's hair right there, Okay. And that's what you see me combing. But back into the subject at hand regarding boundaries. I want y'all to remember, whether it's family, friends, I don't care what it is. You have to set boundaries for your life. And you have to be willing to stick to them. And in me setting boundaries, I have to do it alone. I have to learn how to do a lot of stuff alone because I will allow everyone so much access to me and I'm giving and giving and giving and giving and then when it's time for me to either need, want or desire, I have to look around and refer back to myself. And I don't ever want to get in a selfish mind frame where I stop being who I am and I never want to get into a mind frame where I'm unlikable because I'm just so consumed into me, but I want to get back into a space and play child, child, here she go cutting up, here she go. But real quick, I want to get back into a space and a place where I enjoy my company so much. I don't require or need the company of anybody else, child. And doing this hair gives that to me. Okay. Now let me give you another style. And let's get up out of that soft stuff. Bow. Baby, I can't wait to wear my hair like this in public. Baby, I can't wait to wear my hair. And who not finna get no knockaballs? Who not finna get no knockaballs? As you can see, I hadn't even got into the subject, child, and the video is already done. The wig is on my head. When they say glueless, the wig is oh my god. The wig is on my head. Baby, do you know how long I've been wanting some space buns and ain't got enough hair on the side? Do you know how long I've been wanting some space buns? But if you want to be modern and super regular, look at that. Baby, I kid you not. Y'all are going to get sick of me in this wig. Y'all are going to get sick of me in this wig. And one of these days, it's going to turn into a bob because y'all already know how I roll. But for now, because I feel like I'm a Barbie girl, girl, when I'm changing my hair like that, and as I'm sitting here, I keep getting ideas and it's big forehead friendly. Look at girl half. I love me a good old nasty half up, half down. And y'all already know how I roll. Every day is a retro day. Excuse me. We have another one. Let's go. So if you want to have it laying flat, lay your head down low. That's not even a song. But if you jam to it, then let's jam to it together. Baby, I absolutely love this wig. If you cannot tell, again, set those boundaries. Stick to those boundaries. Teach people how to love and treat you. Okay? Now, be a Barbie girl. And in your Barbie world, you can be a kin too and all that other stuff. That's the hair that shed it. And that was it. Bye.